episode, Classmates. My name is Gina Bruna, and today I am going to talk about how my English classes will be when I go back to my country. I divide in two parts. The first part, I am going to explain you about the critical concepts that I will use in my future classes. And the second part, I will explain you, and by the use of an astrology, how my classes will be. First, I am going to start with a question. What is a teacher? Being a teacher is not only getting a degree. It's not only to get a position in a specific institution. Being a teacher is not only standing in front of the class and in mechanical way explaining concepts, structures. Being a teacher is to give a hand to the student and show to my student the way. Being a teacher is to help to my student to be their own knowledge. How? By using methods, strategies that help me not only easy to help my students to be better tomorrow. That will help, that will help me to be a best teacher too. Now, I choose one of the concepts that is biography driving. Why do I, I choose this concept? If I know that my student come from a poor, uh, poor uh, family, if I know that my student come from another country, or if I know that my student knows about other language, what my students like, what my students don't like, it will help me to understand my students. For that reason, I choose this concept. Now, affective filter. If I see my students, if I see my students serious, if I see my students frustrated, if I see my students anxious, I am not going to come just here and judge to my students and say, why do not smile? No, that means that the teacher needs to have a little space after the class and say, Pepito, Come with me. I am going to talk with you. Then sitting with that student, watching the eyes and say, hey, what happened with that? Can I help you? I'm with you. Then I can sit to my student in my classroom, sharing and enjoying my class. For that reason, I choose affective behavior. Because this is going to help me to be a better teacher in my class. Now, Pepsi up. Look my hand. It's not the same, any finger. It's not possible to have the same level of students in my classroom. So what I am going to do is this concept is going to help me to break them divide. I don't want to make a magic trick in my classroom and say everybody has the same level. No. I just want to plan well planify that each level give a space in, give a step in front. Just that I will feel comfortable that my student learns something. For that reason, I choose Pepsi. Yeah. Next, group configuration. In this part, my students should know how to respect each idea. My students should know how to respect their way of being to each of the students in order to cooperate and in order to know what is the ability of each one and cooperate and help to each one to get the group benefit. For this reason, I think this is very important to use in my classroom because it will help me not only to have individuals in the class, it will help me to have good person in my classroom to understand and respect to each other. Next, the shatter method. The shatter method I choose is special hands-on. Because this hands-on, I love it. When my students touch, feel, smell, they will learn. And also, they will keep the knowledge for a long time. What you touch, what you do, you apply in your life. And that is what I want. That my, my students learn in the classroom, not in a mechanical way. I need that my students learn and use the knowledge in their lives. Now, if I do, if I 
if this group is totally clear for me, what is the right one? Please, happy faces in my classroom. What? Enjoying my class. Because I know what is happening on each of my students. That is what I want for my future classes. That is all about my critical concepts. Now, about my class. She 
got some nuts on the pan and say, please don't eat me, don't eat me. Okay, you were here. <laughs> and don't be really <laughs> She was jumping all the way. Elias, come quickly, where were you? You were in the Excellent, perfect, very good. So here, Christian was in the elephant. Monica, on the elephant. Carla, behind the elephant. And here, in front of. Do you remember? Who the elephant stopped on? Well, let's suppose the teacher was there too. Okay, so teacher was here, poor teacher. Now, the question is, ah, Elias, where is Elias? No, where is the helicopter? Over. 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 Okay, now, so we are going to talk about, what is the topic? Prepositions of place. What are my objectives today? My objective is, please help me read in the first objective. Listen for specific information. Excellent. Thank you, Lene. What is the second? Talk about where people or things are. Very good. Mireya, help me please. Write about where things are. Excellent. Viviana, please say, I'm sorry, match sentences and draw eight. Excellent. So that is our objectives for this class. Now, continue. I said the question is, where is, where is Monica? Excellent. She is on the elephant. Very good. She's on the air. Now, what are we going to do is here I have featuring words. Here, please take it. You can pass. Could you pass that, please? And also, wait a minute. that you have to match, you have to read a sentence and draw in this part. You are going to work in couples. One is going to have, one is going to have the white one, you have to take two, and the last one I am going to dictate one which you have to draw, okay? Do you understand? First, I am going to give these two cards, each one, each one takes just one color. For example, here you took uh, two whites and you two green. What are you going to do is to match the sentences. Here I have, for example, says number one. The magazines are in the school bag. Okay. So what I do, what I have to do, is to draw here mm. magazines in the school bag. And in the lines, I am going to draw, to write a question. Where are the magazines? The magazines are in the school bag. Is it clear the instruction? Yes. Yes. Very good. So now, two, 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 Markers. So 
Thank you for your attention. 